Welcome to the InstaSpin FOC Launch Pad and Booster Pack training video. This is a six part series. Part one is the introduction, the overview, and resources. To get started, let's go download the latest version of Motorware. I recommend signing up for the Alert Me feature. This will send an email to you each time that we revise the Motorware package, which is about every two months or so. Go ahead and download Motorware and follow the installation instructions. Once installed from the default directory, you'll see a Motorware executable. Go ahead and double click that. Motorware is our software infrastructure and the way that we build all of our projects for InstaSpin FOC and InstaSpin Motion. And this executable is simply a graphical way to view all the content that was delivered in Motorware. For the launch pad and booster pack, you'll want to be aware of a few different things. First, in the resources section, you can specifically look at the new launch pad with links to the tool folder, the wiki site, the quick start guide that came included in the box, the kit readme first, the GUI quick start guide, and the hardware packages. Please read through the kit readme first, which will give you an overview of the process of using your launch pad and then look at the GUI Quick Start Guide to guide you through the setup of using the GUI Composer tools. The GUI can be found inside the specific uh, application for InstaSpin FOC under the Piccolo 2X version for the GUI. You'll need to go through the GUI installation which will put the GUI Composer components onto your PC and again this is the same universal GUI Quick Start Guide which will walk you through the process of identifying and running your motor. Also included in the resource section is a booster pack category. This also has the tool folder online and online downloads for the booster pack specific hardware guide and all the hardware design files. The other documents that you're going to be using significantly are the InstaSpin Projects and Labs User's Guide. This is the guide to all the software infrastructure and walks you through how to use the embedded code to build up your system. You'll also be using the InstaSpin FOC and Motion User's Guide. At this point, the next step is to work through the Universal GUI Quick Start Guide, which will let you install GUI Composer onto your system and learn how to build your first binary that you can download onto the launch pad to start spinning your motor. By the end of reading through the quick start guide, you should be able to launch your own GUI and get started identifying and then spinning your motor.